The CenturyLink calendar has the Seahawks getting ready for a run through the NFC West beginning Sunday with the Cardinals. The only non-conference matchup, December 7th, on the road against the Eagles. You can no longer call the Arizona Cardinals a fluke. At this point, they have won six straight. They They're are very good. good. Exactly. <laughs> uh, last week, uh, yeah. the Detroit Lions couldn't even score a touchdown against them. So what makes this defense so tough? Well, they're really good against the run, first of all, and they bring a lot of pressure. They play from all over the place. Their defensive coordinator, Todd Bowles, is very aggressive. And they've got the corners in the back end, Patrick Peterson and also Antonio Cromartie. They can lock down your receivers so they can play a lot of man for man and just bring a lot of people with your quarterback and try and stop your running game at the same time. So they've been very, very effective, creating a lot of turnovers and a lot of havoc for offenses. All right, so now Carson Palmer's out. Drew Stanton is in. He didn't have a great game. Actually, uh, threw a couple of touchdowns his first two series, but then he was Drew Stanton <laughs> after that. Yeah, well, you know, he's, he's about a 50% passer. He's a, just an average quarterback, no question about it. He makes enough big plays for them to win football games and doesn't hurt them very much. So. Uh, he's a guy we're going to have to really do a good job on their wide receivers because that's where he likes to throw the football, but that's one of our strengths is our corners. So we should, we should be playing right into uh, to their strength as far as how they want to throw the football, and hopefully we can make some turnovers against them as well and create some big plays for ourselves on defense. Yeah, it's a critical game, and the Seahawks have him here. At CenturyLink Field, twelve rest up. Enjoy your week, everyone. The Warren on Manji.